Hey family, we're gonna do this dish with as little cleanup as possible because I'm dog tired. I done took a couple of naps, went to sleep for a while, and after I eat this, I'm going back to bed. So, minimum cleanup, maximum taste. Mm, good stuff, good stuff. Let's go! Hi. My name is T. I am not a chef. Actually, I'm a truck driver. And I don't drive food trucks. I drive a semi. What I'm about to do is show you how to do what I do on my truck. Welcome to your favorite new food show. Big taste in a small space with me, T. So my mortar and pestle I've been hiding for a while, but I like it. I got some white peppercorns, pink peppercorns, black peppercorns. Put them in the mortar and pestle, crush it up a bit, added a little bit of fennel seed, some coriander seeds, and some rosemary, crush that up, add some ajwan seeds, uh, tastes like, tastes like, uh, Crush that up. It tastes like time. A little oil, a little Worcestershire, a little dark soy, some chili oil, some sweet soy. Put all that in a bag with the crushed up stuff. A little salt, a little uh, garlic powder. Mush it up, marinate it, let it sit for a little while. I got some baby eggplant, two different kinds. Cut them up. Put them in another bag, little oil, the rest of the seasoning. Got my baking pan out. And they're in my, I got my aluminum foil on my baking pan. Line everything up. Oh, the broccolini, I put that in the reserve juice from what I marinated the meat in. Cook it for about 30 minutes on 375. Then I put it on broil, stuck it on top. Let that go for another 10 minutes till it gets some nice browning and crisping on there. And voila! Bon appetit! It is baked veal chops, some broccolini, some eggplant, a little, a little, a little seasoned Japanese seaweed. And some kimchi. Oh, yeah. Throw the aluminum foil away in the paper plates. Clean up your fork and your knife. Hey, dinner's done. And so am I. I'm tired. <laughs>